Hey everyone, today I'm playing a game called The Devil Haunts Me. But the power of Christ compels you! Right off the bat, it's got a pretty nice intro screen. Got some pixel art, got some noise filter, chromatic aberration going on. I believe this was made for a game jam called A Game By Its Cover, and that's a game jam where people design these fake game covers. Well, I think the fake game covers were designed at some other point in time. And then developers take these covers and make little game jam games out of them. Shit just got real. Axe plus tree equals wood. Gun plus thing equals other thing. I can't tell what most of these are. The third one looks like water. Fourth one looks like water too. Okay. I think this is a survival game. Okay, there's an axe. And there's a gun. I can only hold one. It said to mix the water, the bucket with the water. Okay, we got a bucket of water. What am I gonna do with this water? I dropped the water. Okay, let's get some wood. You know, survival game stuff. Collecting. So I've been collecting for eight long years. I have a little bar in the bottom. I think that's my energy. Every time I swing the axe, I lose some energy. So I think this is a horror slash survival game, if you couldn't tell by the graphics and everything. Saw some monsters in the screenshots, so they might show up later. <laughs> I don't think I can hold more than one thing at a time. The character animation is very strange. He does not have any arms. His legs are like going into his body when he walks. Maybe I have to get water and bring it back. Zero water seems like a bad thing. We also don't have any meat. For the hungry boy. Maybe that's what it is. We shoot things with a gun and we get meat that way. Very, uh, don't starve. Minimalist don't starve. Oh, there's a deer thing. Well, I can't fight it because I can only hold one tool at a time. I have to run all the way back home to get the gun. I want you to give me the gun. Oh, he's running away. Is he gone? Did he just disappear? I think there was a- oh, zoom out. Okay, well... That helps quite a lot. It makes things much easier. Uh, is that a head? There he is! I have no idea. I can't walk around with it zoomed out, otherwise I would. It freezes you when you zoom out. Salt circle, but no house. Here, draw a circle! Okay! I guess that keeps enemies away. Oh, there's water. Well, that's great, but I'm extremely far away from the house. It'd be great if you could just hold all the tools. The movement speed and everything, it stinks having to run all the way back here. Oh, spooky monster. New island. Oh, there's water over here. Sweet. Oh, this thing is actually attacking me now. Okay. Salt circle. Safe. But the power of Christ compels you! Oh. Golden axe. Fancy. You can cut down trees with two swings instead of three. I don't want to lose my golden axe. Maybe it upgrades the one back at home too. Oh, this thing again? <laughs> Leave me alone. Ouch. Oh, I took damage. I only have two health. Okay. Ah, hey. <laughs> Can't just spawn on me when I leave the house. But the power of Christ compels you! And I can't shoot past the trees. Because <laughs> their hitbox is giant. A sword. Okay, can't shoot that thing, I guess. Oh, this guy again. Well, I'm probably gonna get killed. Dead. Let's see what happens. Does it start completely new? Yep, it does. That was The Devil Haunts Me. For a game jam game, that was pretty good. Quite sizable. <laughs> yeah, boy. I don't know about that spooky monster that floated around. You can't really do anything about him. If you're not close to the salt circle, you're just gonna take damage either way. That was an oval! It has to be a circle! So, give it a shot. Alright, see you later, folks.